cop spawn. Nice. Just at the right spot as well. Leader. Is it really in an action if you can only vote for one guy? <laughs> From my point of view, no. Nobody voted for them. Besides themselves, of course. What fishing boats have been destroyed by marauding vikings? <laughs> marauding vikings! Yes. Oh, over there, there's a frigate. And another island paradise invaded and conquered. Your society can now implement the civic police state. No, no, I do no. not want that. No, we, yeah. The old ways are the best. The old ways are the best. Let's build Mount Rushmore.
they have some cities in Australia as well. Hmm. It is producing 107 gold as well. Nice. All right. Destroy everything. Mm -hmm. Buy buy a holy city. <laughs> Poo. We should be close to domination victory now. Yeah, we have sixty four percent of the world population. And 53% of the land area. We, we need more land area. So I think you need to capture the city, not destroy them. I think they're really concede. Okay.
Huh? Just what happened? Fishing boats now. Seriously. Uh, right. Seriously. Okay, and now I've found Sid Sushi Corporation. You have just ah, in the very city. nice. Yeah, it's very important to build uh, your corporation, to found your corporation in the city with which has Wall Street. Because that way the revenues get multiplied the most. And you get four gold for each city which has this corporation. And now we're basically never going to stop building Sushi's executive in this city. For the rest of the game, I guess. Game over. Nice. Everyone is our vassal state. Oh. Lots Boomman did it once again. Good job. And immigrants. Yep. A conquest victory. So. That's how we do it with three persons. I hope you enjoyed watching the game. That's my first conquest victory. Oh, nice. Yeah, I think it was a nice game. So see you around, folks. Bye bye. Bye. All right, folks, I'm back. I just wanted to show you the graph, the history graph from this game and because this is a marathon game it will take forever at the normal speed so I'll speed it up just a little Spoon, Chris, me Maybe I just want to speed up a little bit more Notice how, how all the computer players are expanding way faster than we are. That's because of the difficulty mode. So basically, at Noble, the game plays at its full capacity. The AI does everything it can think of. And above that, the computer is, starts cheating in a kind of way. So. The settler for the computer is cheaper to build than the settler for us human players. So he gets a discount on units and he gets a discount on size as well. Just my nice expand here. Getting as much land as possible. Spoon did a really good job there as well, I think. And Chris had a very bad start. I have to say that again, um, being over there really was no fun. Because those cities over there are not very strong. Had not much to do. And now a big conquest.
spoon got that city, but he'll lose it again eventually. Now making ants over here. Huge progress made there. against America, Washington. Oh, Spoon. Big expansion over there. Conquering Russia, covering in red. But it's Japanese red, so not quite the same again Chris yeah he got some cities over there but I think with North, North America was really a turning point for him in this game because North America is really strong but it costs a lot of money in upkeep and I had to to aid him with money per turn yeah and I missed our little island skirmishes over there and that's it. Everyone is out of us out now. Hope you had fun and maybe learned some bit, got some ideas for your own games. See you around.